Icy Hot Beats. Hey guys, I just want to give you a real quick uh, two-part heads up on uh, some products here. So we're looking at the KO Custom uh, Kydex holster and then the uh, PL Mini 2 from Olight. All right now, uh, I know there's a lot of people out there that are going to uh, be disparaging about the potential quality of Olight and I totally understand that. Uh, being a huge fan of Surefire and whatnot myself. All right, so uh, I will say this as far as I know Olight is the only company making a viable flashlight for uh, Your subcompact pistols. All right, there's uh, the streamlight option Which wraps around the the trigger frame or trigger guard uh, or or the rail depending on what you've got but it's a hundred lumens uh, which at that point kind of why even bother? Okay, so you, you win some, you lose some with the the build quality on the Olight, uh, but you get an actual flashlight. Okay, so uh, take it or leave it. Uh, it's it's a viable option in my mind uh, because it gives you enough light to actually see what you're doing. <clears throat> so uh, Ko Custom Kydex is making holsters that will fit the PL Mini 2. Uh, so that's the the heads up that I want to give there, especially with a 40% off sale coming from Olight. So if you're working with a subcompact pistol that has a rail, uh, the PL Mini 2 is a pretty good option if you're unfamiliar with it. And then KO Custom Kydex uh, are going to be able to hook you up with something that will fit that. Uh, a couple things of note here, I've never seen this done before, I'm sure it has been. Uh, they're using this this tensioning device. Uh, there's a, an Allen screw in there, and it it raises this little leg in here to uh, give more pressure on either the bottom of the flashlight or the trigger guard, depending on your pistol. In my case, it happens to be on the bottom of the flashlight, uh, so I'd never seen that before, and I thought that was worth noting because it uh, it doesn't squeeze the pistol anymore. It gives you that that one specific point of tension there and then the the mini 2 if you're unfamiliar with it has this uh, quick detach here and the way this works is the light slides on the mount so it's gonna give you a pretty universal fit on uh, a lot of pistols, not just your subcompacts. But you can see right there, even on a, a subcompact Glock, you get a pretty even uh, fit. Uh, it pushes the switch all the way back so it's as close to your hand as possible. And uh, it, it'll mount just about anything. And then it's got the, the magnetic charger on the bottom. I will say, I have I don't remember who did it. Uh, I thought it was pretty slick. They had a charger that would take, or a, a holster that would take a charger in the bottom, so you could charge it in the holster. But uh, I don't really think that's necessary. I just thought it was neat. So, Ko Custom Kydex and uh, Olight PL Mini Two, uh, two two good options uh, for kind of an un, unideal uh, situation. <laughs>